Wasn't always this way, but when the Clippers come to town now, it's a hot ticket, Candace. It is a hot ticket. We've seen teams go all in to acquire Kawhi Leonard. Easy to see why. He just changes the course of a franchise. Any team he's on legitimately has a chance to win a title. Oh, got that one up quick. Yeah, here's a list of things I don't want to do, and right at the top is guard that guy. Two minutes remaining in the first. Pass to Hartenstein. And here's Leonard. 14 feet away. And he connects with a jumper. Leonard's got nine. The Cavs trailing. Here's Mobley. And there's a pick. Levert outside. Stolen by Jackson. A minute and a half left in the opening quarter. And that one's long. I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. Pass to A-Train. And he lays it up and in. And Grant, you look at the building blocks of MP's games. He's all about the fundamentals. Yeah, and the fundamentals, B.A., might be boring at times, but they're as important as ever. Glad to see a young star like MP embrace that part of winning basketball. Out to Powell. Shot clock at six. And the foul called on Karis LeVert. That's his first personal foul. Fourth team foul. Kennard, he's checked in for Kawhi Leonard. Wade, he's checked in for the Cavaliers. Here's Jackson. What? No scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Second chance effort. Dan Hartenstein gets it to go. Have to take care of the defensive boards better than that. Yeah, you just can't afford to give up second chance opportunities again and again. Pass to a train. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials. And he can't get the first one. So he comes up empty, missing both. The Clippers in the lead. 20 seconds left in the first quarter. Up top, Jackson. Six to shoot. It's rebounded by A-Train. Laverde, right side. And that's going to be a travel. Clippers. We're about a minute and a half into the second quarter. George with it. Last game we saw him with 32 points. Leonard up top. Six on the shot clock. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Leonard's got 11 points. Well, Candace, this is a question I'm sure you've heard before. But growing up, was there a player or players who you had in your game at? Well, honestly, I was the biggest Allen Iverson fan. So I was the, you know, the center that was going out on the game, trying to throw passes like AI, trying to dribble and get that crossover. So I really loved watching AI growing up. And C. Webb was another player. I loved his versatility. I loved his I'd say it's those two. Nice. The Setting the floor for the Cavaliers. We've got Kevin Love, Colin Sexton out there with Okoro. Then there's Mobley, and it's A-Train in at small forward. Rondo, he's checked in for the Cavaliers. Pass to Leonard. Mo 
Mobley grabs the board. Mobley's got a rebound number five here tonight. Rondo with it, and it's Leonard picking him up. And he was fouled by Leonard. Free throws. And it's going to be on if it's a Zubats. I like that. I mean, some physical play inside. He's not about to give up any easy baskets. Getting themselves to the line this quarter is a good way to get their offense rolling. Leonard outside. Softly drops in the floater. He's got 13. They have no answer defensively inside. To the inside. Oh, George with a steal. Two minutes remain in the first half. And he's going for the oop here. Trying to go for a lob there. Excellent defense and anticipation to stop it. Pass to Akuro. Here's a train. Leonard defending. Here's a train. And it's all from three point range. The Clippers have gotten six of nine attempts to go in the second. Looking good. Here's Leonard. The Cavaliers pull it in. Love's got six rebounds here tonight. Well, Candace, thanks so much for joining us and sharing your insights into the game. Thank you so much. It's always a pleasure. And hearing Candace cover the game, she really understands the connection between players and fans. There's no doubt that the stories draw us closer. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. It's a line for your foot. Candace Parker's oh, wow. care factor is at an all-time high. For the Clippers, Powell comes in for Paul George. And it's Jackson in for man. Markkinen's checked in for the Cavaliers. And everyone knows what an elite defender Kawhi Leonard is. I mean, he's a former defensive player of the year. And he can still shape games with his defense. Leonard on the take. And yeah, that one's good. Cool. Leonard's got eight here in this quarter. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for the Clippers. They've come out in full attack mode defensively, applying pressure and stealing it away repeatedly. For some reason, they've also had guys in the right spots on the offensive glass. Lots of putbacks. Down to five on the shot clock. Pass to A-Train. Here's Rondo. Off target from outside. The Clippers have gone seven for 11 in the second quarter. Back to Jackson. Leonard outside. Drives to the hoop. Ooh, he's found his rhythm. Seven for ten and counting. And coach applauding the night Kawhi Leonard is having. He's totally in the zone. Outside. Rondo. Here's a train. Rebounded by Kawhi Leonard. Leonard's got his fifth rebound in this one. Got a hand on it. And so we wrap up the first half. The, the, first the Clippers on. With a score. Your Clippers. 33. At the line for your Clippers. No Mostly to power. sign a longer contract the with the Clippers. And in just two years, he has shown his value for this franchise. So they felt the same, and both are now linked for the next four years. Look, Kennard out there with Kawhi Leonard. Then there's Ivica Zubats. Then it's Jackson, and it's Powell in at the two. That's who's out there for the Clippers. Leonard outside. It's tipped. Here's a train. Powell with a steal. Pass to Jackson. And counted from 19 feet away. Jackson's got four points in the quarter. So it's the Cavaliers now. It's a 10-point game. Here's Mobley. He's guarded by Zubats. And down it goes. Two points. It's not easy to work the ball inside in this league, but they've done it all night. Jackson, the pass to Zubat. Kennard, left side. From the arc. Knocks down the long day. Kennard's got his second bucket on the night. And in the second half here, they're shooting a terrific percentage from three. 
Last two A train. On the wing, Sexton. Levert outside. To the paint. Here's A train with four on the clock. Who poked away? Stolen by Kennard. And so it's the Los Angeles. The end of the third quarter with a score. Your fans. Your Clippers. It's a fan at John. That's the game, folks. And the Clippers are. Now I'm hearing MP went to M, Harvey Lesser, to complain about a lack of playing time. I blame you, Mr. Lesser. Can you believe that? A rookie, this early in the season, going to a GM to talk about playing time? This got to be a joke, plain and simple. Back in my day, which was not too long ago, thank you very much, you had a problem with your coach? You went to him and you talked about it man to man. But that's this new generation, softest tissue paper. They think everything should be handed to them because they're famous. It's not the way it goes. Well, I got news for you, MP. It doesn't work that way in the NBA. You got to earn it the old-fashioned way. No, no amount of crying to a GM is going to fix that. If you're crying, what the babies going to do? Well, we're looking at teams with first-year coaches, Chris. How long do you think it usually takes to get up to speed with a new system? You know. Probably for the Lakers. Mike Howard's checked in for Anthony. Horton Jocker comes in for James. Monks checked in for Avery Bradley. And it's Kendrick Nunn in for Russell Westbrook. Then for the Cavaliers, Markinen, he's checked in for Love. A-Train comes in for Jetty Austin. And it's Colin Sexton in for Rajon Rondo. Okoro, wide open, he fires! And he can't stop the run as he misses. And on the glass so far, it hadn't even been close. Two minutes. Gun gets the Monk. Two minutes. Davis setting the pick for none. Six on the shot clock. Three pointer. It's rebounded by Cleveland. 143 left in the first quarter. And marking in out of Finland, Greg was one of the hot names in free agency this last summer. And surprisingly, didn't get an extension before the season. Just hard to find seven footers that can shoot like Markinen. You knew at least a few teams would try and lure him away. Here's Davis, and no good that time. Cavaliers go the other way with it. Last game matched up with the Clippers. A tough loss there. Actually, I thought they might be able to sustain that momentum that they picked up in the fourth quarter, but was not meant to be. Outside, Markinen. That one, no good. Great D that time from Howard. 
And it's Davis with the ball for the Los Angeles Lakers. They're leading by eight. 43 seconds left to play in the first. And so it looks like the Lakers will retain possession here. Wade is checked in for Cleveland. Kyrus Levert comes in for a curl. None passes to Horton Tucker. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. Out of bounds, Out of Cleveland ball. takes possession. Cleveland ball. Hey, don't give him an inch, don't give him an inch. Great team. The Cavaliers trail by eight. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Here's A-Train, he's guarded by Davis. And here's Los Angeles. They're on an 18-7 run. And the Lakers with another miss. Here's A-Train. At the elbow, it's Markinen. And the last shot at the buzzer doesn't go in for him. And so it's four. And your Lakers. Lakers. Howard's checked in for LeBron. Anthony Davis comes in for Anthony. And Taylor Horton Tucker subbed in for Monk. Davis finds none. About three minutes played so far in the second quarter. And it's Davis missing. Two That's the kind of D half. you need when he's got the ball near the hoop. They were all over. So with LeBron on the bench. This is who Frank Vogel is out there. Howard and AD play together down on the block. Bradley is out there with Kendrick Nunn. And it's Horton Tucker in at the three spot. Nunn against Rondo. And the basket is good. And a closer look here at the hustle stats for Los Angeles. They deserve a lot of credit for the defense they've played in the paint here early. Contesting shots, blocking shots, just making life difficult on their opposing shooters in general. And also, they've been really active on the defensive end in terms of applying pressure. That's a big way to steal. And we've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. Anthony Davis, of course, is a superstar at both ends of the court. LeBron James says his ability to guard anybody on the floor, one through five, take the challenge to guard on the perimeter, and continue to protect the paint, it's hard to score on him. Guys? DA is a lead in every way. As are you. Thank you. Okoro passes to Santos. And here is Okoro. Just five on the clock. A fadeaway. And he overshot that one, missing. That was an easy jump shot into a tough one by going to the fadeaway. Look what happened. Yeah, to Horton Tucker. Back to nine. This is it to Brent. Now Davis. Excellent D there from Markinen. He's been off the mark, but somehow he hasn't held him back as a team. Here's Santos, stolen by nine. Last break, the Lakers. Outside for Davis, jacks up a three. Doesn't get a good drop for him. So that'll be it for the first half. Fair the score. Thirty. The Cavaliers. Twenty-five. Cavaliers. Substitution. Let's check in for Anthony Davis. Monk comes in for LeBron. And it's Kendrick Nunn in for Russell Westbrook. Here's Lavert. He's got eight. Sexton the pass to Santos. It's stolen by Bradley. And so in the game for the Cavaliers, Colin Sexton is out there with Kyrus Lavert. Then there's A Train. Then it's Lowry Markinen. And it's Wade in at center. Monk the pass to Nunn. 
Howard with a screen on Sexton. And the call on Damian Wade. That's his first personal foul. The team is in the pocket. 90%. At the and with a stroke like that, that, you see why. And so none nails both of them. Oh, he's never rattled at the strike. Always has that nice soft touch on his free throws. Sexton gets a screen from Santos. Inside. What? Come on, Rev. That's a soft the foul. For Two shots. That free throw good from Santos. He's off on the second. Wade passes to Santos. Lock at six. Cleveland needs to get a shot off here. On deep. Avery Bradley pulls it in. Bradley's got four rebounds now tonight. And got to like what they've been doing down low in the post. Rebounded by Santos. Those are chances almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D just enough to keep him out of rhythm. 35 seconds left to play in the third. Santos, the pass to Wade. Cleveland moving the ball around. Shot clock at six. Shoots a fader, and it's good for two. Wade. Wade's got his second bucket. Now the bounce pass is the ticket there. Very nice assist. None against Sexton. Bradley sets the pick for none. Monk kicks to Bradley. Well, good with the triple. And the game still closely contested as the four. The Lakers. 40, all right, look who's coming under the court. Get loud, here they are, your. Yeah. The final bucket, and your Lakers win. Your Lakers, 85. Tori's in the house, what's up, bud? You look good on the court tonight, but don't you think... Look, AT, when I find something I want. So I'm coming to the end of my YouTube video right now, so give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much. Click on that bell button to subscribe for more content, and if you saw the recent video interesting, share the comment right below the description so you can share some positive feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome. So 
and make a happy Corona 95. You'll have a great day and peace out.